Welcome back to Spicy Tech. I am Mark. I'm Cry. And today we're running FSD 11.4.4 and we'll be using this to go through some rush hour traffic as well as we also took some feedback from our subscribers who mentioned that they wanted to have like an overlay of our route to see to see the tran uh, to see how we navigate with the right turns and left turns and so on. So we did it. So thank you again for the feedback. And of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, click the notification bell, share our videos too as well, so that way we can we can get some uh, some traction going here. Of course, thank you for subscribing, all our subscribers. We have had quite a few, and uh, really appreciate that. Yeah, we're just celebrating our 400 subscriber mark, and thank yes. you to everyone Woo! so much yes. for supporting us. We love you very much. Hugs and kisses. Hopefully and we Marcia. hit 420 just now. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Marsha's uh, gonna send you a big kiss <laughs> if you subscribe and add to that count. We're going here a little bit uh, spicy. We have a yield sign in front of us. But yeah, we just came around that roundabout. We went through smoothly. I didn't have to intervene or anything. And then she found herself onto the left lane. I mean, I prefer preferably would have went to the right side and then get myself on the left position wise. If there were cars behind, that would have been a little bit tricky, confusing for them. So, um, but it was all right. It was good. Didn't have to disengage for that one. We have a left turn here and it's all clear. And she can make that really well. I What's just that? really don't didn't like. Didn't go over the line. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I didn't go over the line, but I just really, really don't like when we are making a left turn like that, and she wants us to, you know, <laughs> to press <laughs> on the steering wheel so that way we can get. A oh, system, I see. You know, in this, the middle of the maneuver. Mid, in the yes. middle of a, of yeah. a yeah, high curvature maneuver, and it tends to disengage when you apply pressure like that. So you have to be mm. really careful. Yeah, then you might end up going into the other, the other person's turning lane or into somebody else. It's kind of dangerous, right? Exactly, yes. Yeah. Um, but yeah, you can see here that... Oops, oh, we have slow. that red light. Wow. Jeez. <laughs> We have really a red light here, <laughs> but you can see though in advance that she's trying to get herself into position to make that right turn that's coming up, and that's really that's good. That's really nice. That's really yeah. impressive, yeah. Because before we used to be, you know, right up there, and then now finally making uh, a right turn when the right turn is like fifty meters away, it's a couple couple meters away, which isn't good because then you have to yeah. now try to squeeze yourself inside of that gap, and you know instead of trying to make it more responsive and trying to get into gaps quickly. Perhaps to read the if it can get into the actual lane position correctly before the turn, that could be secondary or something. You know, like if you understand what I'm trying to say, like instead of trying to do that last minute, that last minute lane change, yeah, and trying to have quick decisions, the better thing would be to try to position yourself to make the lane change in advance. Of course, yeah, but yeah. but there is something though that we have to test because the thing is, a right turn is conveniently on the right lane where we're supposed to be yes. so i want to see if she's going to do the same thing for the lefts mm. because like she by default will go to the right because that's the correct way of driving but like is she going to go to the left early or is she going to try to prioritize like the fact that it's supposed to be oh we can yeah we go. can go okay so she yeah. recognizes that and she goes that was good yeah i just want to see if she's yeah. going to prioritize like the fact that you should be in the right lane more often and not be in the left too too early because technically that is incorrect but at the same time like it's better especially during high traffic times to remain more on the the right side to just do your maneuvers super super early, early exactly yeah. okay yes agreed oh, oh shoot i uh, think we have to check that one out it's funny okay let's see here she can go that's all set 
kind of fast though for no reason. I'm kind of wide. I would remain more on the right side, but that's, I mean that's okay. Yeah, just no, but the, just in case some people might have been turning left inside, so it's a little bit not so good. But it's it's okay. There was no one behind. No, um, there's no one making a left, so that's the most. And it would improve with time yeah. too as well. So that was good. This is also good too as well. So this is this is perfect. That was nice. That was clean. I think we had some trouble there a couple times, right? Yes. Okay, and we're remaining on the right here. side here with this wide road with no lane marking, so that's good. We also have yeah. a bunch of gravel on the right side, so she's remaining. She's actually creating that barrier there from it, which is impressive. And she's seeing like this as, as debris. Oh, she's stopping right behind, that's right good. in front of the stop sign. That's perfect. Uh, she can go up. Seems legal enough. <laughs> yeah, I would more go up with some more, with some with some more purpose, yeah, and she did that. Close to the dirt. I had to give her some jewels there. Okay. Because she would have stayed there for, who knows how long. <laughs> oh really? Okay. Yeah. It's interesting. Because it was a little bit tricky, right? Because of the construction. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. So we're going. And now we have our now. left turn coming up here. Into an immediate right, it looks like. Uh, this is a uh, yeah this is a tough one yeah because we have some a fence on the right side blocking our visibility and i mean she can go now if she wants uh, she has to go quickly right though. she has to go quickly though so i'm gonna give it some jewels just to do it quickly. and yeah giving us some jewels all now some okay. intervention here because we have to make that right turn and i'm hoping that i think we should be indicating so. yeah okay she is she is uh, who's hungry? Oh, we gotta keep that in here on too. Yeah, I just wanna disengage her because she has to position herself into the right lane. She needs to position herself into the right lane to make that right turn. Can I engage here? We have a green light and we can go right off the bat. So that was good. Okay, I don't know why she's seeing this corner so hard though. Oh my gosh. I'm pretty wide too as well. That's not good. I'm probably anticipating the left turn coming up. I'm not too sure, but. Yeah, she but be that more on the right too side. close to that line, and it was very fast. Like you don't need to take mm. those so fast. Like you can just right. slow down and then you can accelerate. But it was just like a full acceleration, if that makes sense. That wasn't too bad in terms of acceleration. I was. I just fine. didn't like how we almost ended up in the other, the opposite lane. <laughs> yeah. No, that, it was, she was fine. She was right okay. behind the line. It was just a little wide for the lane itself because she had a space on either side. She could have just remained on the right yeah. side. Yeah. I mean, the only thing is, if I were driving on the other side, I would probably freak out and be like, "Why are they coming in my lane?" I guess yeah. So it was kind of scary for the other people around. We gotta go. So she has to go now. There's a person She's trying to make. Yeah, okay. I think she was trying to stop because of the countdown. I'm not no, sure. No, not a countdown. The car in front of us was making a, a, a chain in, in, in the middle of the intersection, oh, so she I had to slow down. But the response time should be a little bit quicker because she had to slow yeah. down and then uh, hopefully we will see some improvements with that. Oh, okay. She doesn't break this, uh, this light, so that was good. <laughs> contrary that, to what like we the, the minimum like the bare minimum <laughs> <laughs> well contrary to what we see all the time breaking lights and stuff like that I that doesn't seem to be bad. any issues we haven't had any issues with that so far so that's, that's I don't okay. think for a while to be honest yeah. I don't think we ever even then like sometimes it's just like a close call oh but we did have that time when it was like stopped completely engaged and then it was like trying to go through the red light but that wasn't this update, that was like a while back. Yeah. So far, so good. Yeah, Look on the fake wood. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so she indicates with that left turn, she stops. That's good, yeah. That's good, yeah. Good visibility. I'm just imagining like one day everything is self driving and like indicators not even needed. You just send a Bluetooth signal <laughs> to the surrounding cars. There's no, you know, everything Everything is connected, so you don't need, uh, wow. <laughs> I, I, I will work in Tesla's favor because now you don't need indicators, you, you could remove it. That's going to help, of course, it's going to be super cheap. <laughs> get more battery life. Everything will just be super cheap to manufacture because everything is connected. In a self-driving world, you don't need an indicator, like, but we need to indicate right now. <laughs> <laughs> is she going to make this turn uh, here with this gap? Mm, she's creeping up. 
She's realizing uh, it. Don't yeah, like that wasn't that, that wasn't oh my good. Gosh. Like she could have done it way earlier. I mean, the car wasn't going fast at all. But still, that was pretty dangerous. But it was kind of uncomfortable, yeah. Left turn a little bit uncomfortable. Should have waited, or should have made the turn a lot earlier. So I'm not too sure what you folks think about that one. Is it that she she really can't? In, it takes a while for her to interpret the speed of the oncoming car. I mean, if if I realize for me personally, if I realize the car is moving slow, and I and I did see the car was moving slow, I would have made that turn a lot earlier, and I believe that didn't happen. To me, it looked like they were going pretty fast, actually. So mm -hmm. that's a bit of difference in perspective there. Perhaps yes. So maybe she was trying to figure out because maybe they were just going the speed limit, and like she was trying to gauge like how many how much time she had to make that turn. Mm -hmm. Or whatever language she thinks in, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> math, <laughs> something. <laughs> but the acceleration, though, it should be a little bit, a little bit more because right now, you know, there's a car right behind us, and only now she's accelerating. I had to give her some juice. I had to to pump the pedal a little bit there for her to get up to speed with the car in front, and we should be kind of matching that speed so that way the traffic flows, right? Right. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I guess that's their their safety precautions. Uh, we should be going over to the right, like now. Exactly. She should be getting into into the right, like right now, right yeah, the, away. The right. Um, she's trying to slow down, probably to get into it. This is not. Good. But she's making a left turn. Why is she doing oh. that? There's a right turn that we need to make, but she's indicating and getting into the the left lane, and we yeah. pretty much missed our turn too as well. Missed our turn, wanted to get into the leftmost lane as opposed to the rightmost lane to make the right turn. Okay, we may have to get ourselves in the right. Okay, let's see if she can do it. This one's kind of short, only 200 meters, so that's what I'm worried about. I mean, I would start indicating from now to get into this lane, or perhaps after the, the light. She's looking for a spot. Okay, I think she, she needs to start indicating and getting into get this this lane here. Yeah, she's not gonna make it. She's only now starting to indicate when it's you know. It's way really close. too late. Um, I think she shouldn't be going up. I think she should try and make space. Yeah, I'm gonna have to disengage there because we need to make this right turn here. So you gonna let me okay, in? They Thank gave you. Us some space, nice. Thanks. Oh. All right. And uh, should have get into the lane a lot earlier, indicated, get into the position, and not make that lane change so late. Yeah, we're pretty much. Well, yeah, done, I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna go check that uh, the tires there to see. Yeah, we're gonna have to happened. monitor those those two right tires because that was rough. That that hole was deep and. It was that the sound that it made. It was it, it was, was the hard. worst sound. I yeah, heard, exactly. Yeah. I think the the shocks they, they bottomed out, and so it just hit the actual oh, uh, that's car not good itself. Though. Yeah. Maybe we should actually get that checked. Well, that's the thing about the heavy car, right? So yeah. But, but anyway, any overall thoughts before we close? Um, she was very hesitant to get like, like it was rush hour, and like she was a bit hesitant. I don't like this at all. I mean, that I guess is an all way, but still. Yeah, it's an all way, it's fine. Yeah. So she wants to make that left turn, but she. she she's taking it. very long to make these left turns. Like, look, she's staying so long now, contemplating. She I wanted guess... to make that left turn, you know, by those cars, but then realized the cars were, like, really close oh. to her, so she had to backtrack on it. Yeah. I so, don't know, that was, that was a bit strange. Yeah, overall, it's a little bit, it's a little bit tricky, a little bit meh kind of uh, overall performance. Uh, it was turning out to be pretty decent, but then, um, you know, a lot of late changes, late lane changes coming down to the very end and then making wrong lane changes, coming to, coming up to a right turn, making a far left lane change before making the right, didn't make any sense there. So that was tricky. But let us know in the comments what you think about this. And as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, click the notification bell, and we will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.